little uh, donation opportunity to get in the door kind of thing, but it's not mandatory. It's going to Children's Mercy Hospital. But all kids are welcome. We want them to bring their, sh their works and be showcased, kind of get a, a feel for what it's like to show their work in a real gallery. And if they'd like, they can even put prices on their artwork, see if anybody's interested in selling, learn the ropes of how the professionals work, and uh, just get a feel for it. Get a pat on the back for their talents. And, uh, you know, I think one thing that I would like to do is I'd definitely like to uh, encourage a lot of professional artists to come on out and support a lot of these younger artists because, of course, you know, you were all a, a, you know, a starting, budding artist at one point. And it's a great opportunity for you to go down there and look at the works of all these talented young people, but at the same time be able to offer maybe some uh, some mentoring and, and to be able to kind of give them a little bit of a uh, little bit of a good start. Thank you for bringing that up. That's ideal. It, it, it's such an opportunity to give these kids a place to shine. You know, a lot of different entities uh, promote and celebrate sports and different things for kids, but art doesn't always get the opportunity to shine like like it, it might benefit from. So we're just trying to do a little bit of that. Wonderful. What's well, going to be going on Sunday, April 18th, 2 to 5 p.m. at the lovely 2631 Gallery. And we want everyone to please, please, please come on out. It's going to be a great event for everybody, and um, especially all of the young artists that are going to be involved with this event. I think it's going to be really cool. If they want to get more information, they can also uh, go on your website, correct? Yes, iteenkc.com. And again, as the publisher of iTeen, we, we publish every month works by local teens. So we're always looking for articles, short stories, editorials, poetry, anything the kids want to send in. But this specific event is all about art. And we want to thank the 2631 Gallery and, and Dorothy and um, the entity down there for having us. It was a really nice gesture for them to offer their space to us. Well, and we're really excited. Uh, we've got Thomas Woodward here, who is a... Uh an artist and our curator, and uh, he was a, a teacher for a short while. And again, JT really understands uh, helping kids raise kids up to become artists. Absolutely. Yeah, <clears throat> an event like this can really uh, tend to have a big effect on kids. It's good to see uh, your art on the wall, sometimes outside of the school. Um, a little bit of public feedback won't hurt, you know. And I suggest that all the kids do put a price tag on it. Uh, you never really know what's going to happen. Definitely shouldn't shouldn't uh, catch chips in before you got them, but uh, you never really know what's going to happen. And a uh, little bit of support from somebody can go a long way, you know. Very cool. Well, you were saying that we're friends on Facebook, so send, send if if you are, if you aren't, we're going to find each other because I I'm all about this. I'm all about art and I'm all about young people. So yeah, you, definitely you, we bring this up a lot more. And uh, I think this is an amazing event, and uh, I definitely want people to come out there. And I'm going to tell a lot of my artist friends. And I'm going to be bugging you guys. You need to come on out and support this because it's really worth it. And uh, it's definitely something for the gallery. Right, especially for the kids. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, 2631 Gallery, uh, 2631 Holmes Avenue. Try and keep it easy so you can remember the address. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, the young artists, they really love it. You touched on it earlier. They really love it when they see the uh, older artists come out. You know, it's really yeah. nice to have uh, someone that they may have seen in a first Friday come by and, you know, support them, check out their art, and, you know, I, I've had an artist or two uh, buy a piece of mine in school. You never really know what's going to happen. Very cool. Once again, uh, go on the website at iteenkc.com for more info, or if they wanted to directly email you uh, about placing up a piece of art uh, in the Art Expo coming up Sunday, April 18th, the email address is? Info at iteenkc.com, and we'll give you the scoop, who, what, when, where, and you can get your piece of show. There it is. Once again, thank you uh, again also to uh, 2631 Gallery, you guys. Amazing. Thank you. And what's that? Yeah, just a quick plug. April 2nd, first Friday, we have uh, art opening coming up. Come by and check out the gallery in preparation for the expo. Um, local hip-hop circles will recognize one of the artists showing. Uh, he goes by Brother and Moses when he MCs for N8 Sounds Crew. Uh, oh, yeah. Aaron Sutton and John Sims. So, yeah. Come by and figure out where, where we are, and then uh, come on back and support the kids. There it is. All right. Once again, thank you so much for coming by and discussing this with us. We'll be talking much more about this, and I'll make sure to uh, post some of this stuff up on my blog at kprs.com. Once again, check them out. That is Sunday, April 18th, the I-18 Art Expo at the 2631 Gallery at 2631 Homes. Got unlocked your number one station, Hot 103 Jams. Hot 103 Jams.